Hi, this is Alex from phpacademy.org with a video tutorial for the new Boston. Now in previous videos we have looked into the Ajax function, um, not as much as possible because there are many, 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 um, you know, f many sort of things based around this, uh, this, this request. Uh, there are so many different ways to use it and so many different things we can do with it. However, for now we've looked at um, enough so we can actually post uh, data to a page, retrieve pages, load files, etc. Now, one thing that I haven't mentioned is uh, the the ability to change the um, the method, I guess, uh, as you'd call it in a form, an HTML form. And this is how the data is sent. So we can actually change the way this data is sent uh, for when we pick it up in, for example, page.php. At the moment, I've just created a name variable from um, a, a, well, taken a value from a text field, and I'm posting this to page.php. The data that I'm supplying is name equals, and then I'm supplying this name that has been typed. Now, this will automatically be sent as get data. So we're aut automatically using get data here to post this to page.php. Therefore, inside, for example, page.php, we would have to use dollar underscore get and then name to retrieve uh, this value here. However, what we can do is we can change the type of request uh, inside of our Ajax uh, request altogether. So this is quite simple. All we need to do is um, just come up here. And uh, as one of the parameters that we specify to this uh, request, we can just specify a type parameter. And then obviously we comma separate this. Now this can either be get or it can be post. So now that we've changed this to post, this variable here, which almost looks like a, um, a get variable, I guess, um, will actually be sent as post data. So if you're using the Ajax request and you, are, well, you need to send large amounts of data, uh, or you need to protect page.php against people changing um, you know, values in the URL. Obviously, it's not completely protected because if people can see the variables that you're sending, they will always be able to uh, send data there themselves. However, uh, for these, I guess, two reasons and uh, there are probably a few others, you can change the type to post. So with the Ajax request, not only can you just default send get, uh, you can change type to post to send this uh, same data so you don't there's no need to change uh, the way this data is displayed uh, you can then go on to um, send additional data so text equals hello for example using an ambersand here uh, there's no need to change that at all it will uh, this line here will handle the uh, type of request um, so, uh, you know so it actually changes the request type then when you go ahead and pick it up in PHP uh, you can go and uh, use dollar underscore post instead.